Hi, my name is Emily and I'm a second year medical student vlogging and documenting the highs and the lows of studying medicine in Birmingham, as well as working full time and trying to maintain a healthy lifestyle after failing at the end of last year. Subscribe below to join me every week on my journey to becoming a doctor. Step one, wake up early, gonna rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, it grow hard, that one be. Step four, everybody just do your thing. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. 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 Set your affirmations, aspirations I gotta do the aftermath of preparation Good food, good mood, blood in circulation One step at a time, yeah that's how you make it Set a goal you control and the steps you take them I try to pick one thought, have some concentration And if I make a mistake, it's called education I try to do this every day, call it replication Wake up, today's gonna be a good day Wake up, today's gonna be a good day Wake up Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. 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 Today's gonna be a good day. Some life ain't easy, yo. I think there's a reason, though. Ups and downs, just like every different season, yo. Sometimes I'm high, other times I'm barely breathing, though. I always gotta fight and hide from the demons, yo. Negative thoughts are poison, they ride. Uh. Head full of flowers, so here come the clouds. Uh. They'll never stop unless I can swallow. Morning vlog. So, I am. Um currently in my room and I've done everything I need to do this morning before I leave for med school. So I wrote a little to-do list of what I need to get done today. It's quite a busy day but that's kind of the point of the video is that I'm gonna be studying a lot. Um, but yeah this is my last week at uni before Easter so I want to make sure I get everything in person done and covered and I want to start on my revision this week and it's it's crazy okay guys it's crazy. It's almost exam season. That's wild to me. But yes, so I'm gonna pack my bag and get off to uni where you're just gonna see me studying a bunch. It's been a long time since I walked down the canal because now it's like sunny and I'm morning again. Walking down the canal is like the best bit of my day. It's just so calming. It's like, it's like I wind down on the walk to uni. I just prepare for the day a little bit better when I walk down the canal and just see the ducks. And hopefully soon, little ducklings. <laughs> Heading into the medical school is always challenging for me because I feel very intimidated after I failed and a lot of people here know I failed because that video has almost half a million views now. So if you haven't watched it, I'm impressed. But anyway, I settled into the Doug Ellis part of the building, which is like the little social area on the ground floor. And I got on with some of my flashcards. I just wanted to do some reviews. And then I got on with some lecture work once I had finished that. I just wanted to make sure I'm prepared for any lectures I have that day because I did have a session in the morning straight after this, but it was an anatomy practical, so I wasn't allowed to film. But those group sessions always require some preparation, which is really, really good to get done before the session. Just in case you have any questions. Then I headed onto campus and met my friend Meg and we settled in to this really gorgeous like lounge area in one of the arts buildings. I have never been here before and it was Meg's recommendation. So it was really nice. We got like a little cute booth and we just set up with a bunch of snacks and got on with work. It was hard to stay motivated, but we, we did it. We pushed each other because as soon as one of us was slacking, the other one was focused and we were motivating each other, which was good. We, I had a really good revision session today. Meg, pick me a tree to grow. We're studying so hard, aren't we? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to get on with some mock questions. So, I'm progressing through my to-do list. So we go to them, and we find lecture two, which is right at the start of my notes. When I did it, I've written mock questions that I'll then copy and paste and I'll do one here. Okay. 
We just reached 6,049 minutes for the day. So this is my forest so far for the day. It's looking pretty beautiful. Um, and this is how the to-do list is going. I just have two lectures left to do, which is crazy. So me and Mike are gonna pack up in a couple minutes and head off. I'm gonna go home, have some food because I'm actually hungry. Like pre-workout meals, that thing. Get ready for the gym and tidy up a little bit because my washing will be done so I can put that away, that'd be good. And then we're gonna go to the shop and get some stuff for Meg's Easter egg hunt thing for sailing, for a social, because she's a social sex of sailing. How crazy. Still haven't got the Easter Bunny crush yet. We could go find one. Where? Easter Bunny ears, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Everton Poundland, apparently got Easter Bonnet hat. Then that may be the solution. Easter Bonnet hat from Poundland. <laughs> so we're going to shopping at Poundland. It's time to get ready for the gym. So I've got this white Gymshark Peekaboo Sports Bra and these green Onoractive Effortless Shorts. My new faves, if I'm being honest. So let's get ready for the gym. And that is the fit. I will be putting on a pump cup because it's quite cold on the walk to the gym. But these are my favorites at the minute. One amazing gym session. So, ignoring the fact I look like I just died, I did not. But I hit my squat PB for a triple, I hit my bench PR for a triple, and then like have a bunch of volume sets straight after it. So I did 75 for three on squat, which is my PR. And I did 65 for six sets of five, which is all volume training and it's really painful. But I made it and I did it. And then bench and 45 for three, which is my PR. And then 40 for seven sets of five, which is also just volume training. And it was painful, but it was good. After I get back from the gym, I always make a protein shake to get in that little bit extra protein at the end of the day. I prefer clay whey because it mixes really well with creatine and you can't taste the creatine and the clay whey just tastes like squash so it is my favourite. I may have put a little bit too much cheese in the mash but you know what you can never have too much cheese in the mash. So here's my veggie casserole mix, cheese and mashed potato giant orange pudding and a protein shake with creatine. I'm gonna eat this and head up the stairs. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that. It's been going on for a long time. Anyway, I am um, oh, awake. I need to go wash my face because I forgot to wash off my mascara yesterday. I'm going to go wash my face. Put on my moisturizer. Um, do my washing up, then I'm gonna get dressed to go and meet my friend for breakfast. That is the plan. Also, this leave-in conditioner is actually done wonders for my waves. And it smells really nice. But yeah, so, whoop-de-doo. I really need to get up. But yeah, there's it. Oh, it's only Tuesday. We're doing great, guys. Also, if you're wondering what I take every day, just like five things. I can't actually show the camera without dropping them. There we go. Okay, although I'm running a little bit late, I'm ready to go. My hair looks very wet, but it's not actually wet. I'm not quite sure how I feel, but it is what it is. Um, I'm going to meet my friend for breakfast. Um, I lived with her in first year, so I'm just <laughs> catching up basically. Um, and then I'm gonna go to the library for the rest of the day and then the gym tonight, shocker. Um, but at least I'm ready. I'm gonna get going because I'm late. I had some of the most amazing pancakes and fruit at breakfast, which was great. And then we headed onto campus where me and Tink studied in the library. I didn't film a time lapse in the library, but I did get all my flashcards done in a couple lectures. And then I met up with Meg after her lecture and we headed on for some food and then to the Avon room to study, which is like this cute little purple study space. Here's me intently trying to distract her, but she is so focused on her work, she doesn't even notice. But 
that's what we need, guys, because I was not focused. I was not in the mood. So I then got on with my lectures for the day. I was working really hard because I really, really wanted to finish these. But it's been so hard to stay focused and stay on top of work this year. But we are almost there, guys, and I just needed to finish this. But I got there. It's fine, I probably need a rest day anyway. Oh, you do. Tell the vlog that she needs a rest day. I do. It's one of I think I've fucked out my back a little bit. Yeah, so it kind of hurts to have a rest day. Okay, and I think I was only going to do cardio today anyway, so... Oh, I hate cardio. I cardio in the club. <laughs> She's got um, extreme sports ball tonight. <laughs> I am not going. I am going to study and go to the gym because I'm not drinking. I definitely should be studying. This is not a... A wise decision for next, but <laughs> it's okay. We just finished studying in the Avon room, so we're coming down. I'm gonna fizz you at ten. <laughs> <laughs> You're fizzing in the morning. Don't worry, I'll be getting her up for that because I'm joining. And we're gonna head. We're heading home. Yeah. Well, and I'm gonna study a bit. She's gonna enjoy her life. <laughs> I've got an hour and a little bit to get ready. It takes me an hour and a little bit to get ready. Yeah, so, it takes me five seconds. We'll be pushing for time, but it's okay. And then tomorrow I've got physio, sailing. I'm doing an Easter theme sailing tomorrow. Oh, me and Emily bought twenty pound worth of Easter eggs at Patmore. We did yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm what am I doing tomorrow? I'm going to physio with me. Got I think at uni at eleven, mm -hmm. and then I'm studying, and then shockingly I'm going to go to the gym. Mm -hmm. <gasps> so I'll come with you. I'm going late. I'm going late. And it's cool. In case you were in need of a cute gym transition, here I am getting ready. I was wearing a black Gymshark sports bra and purple honor active shorts. They are my favorites. Gymshark, University of Birmingham joggers, repping the uni. And I'm heading to the gym. The secret to a good gym session is usually for me, caffeine and good music, but it is 10 to eight. So we'll see. I hit another new PR. Ah! This was a 100 kg deadlift for three reps, which is my new personal best on this. I've only ever got it for one in the past, so this is crazy. Oh my god, guys. So, oh my gosh, it looks like a disaster in here. I did do all my washing up, so it's okay. It's not my disaster. Anyway, what am I doing? What am I doing? I'll find you. You can go here. So, hey vlog, I'm back from the gym. Almost died. Honestly, I'm so hot and sweaty right now because the gym has no heating. No air heating? No air con. Anyway, um, I hit my 100 kg times three. You just saw that. I hit it. I'm so happy. And then I did 85 for five reps for six sets after that. And then my bench, which I managed to do 42.5 for pause, which was good. Oh, and then some front squats, so I now have like some pink marks like here. I know you can't really see them on this in this lighting. I have like pink line across here from my barbell. Whoa, whoa. And then I did some glute kickbacks because I want some activation because this program doesn't have any glute work in it. And I mean, other than squats and deadlifts, obviously. But it is something I want to work on isolation. I'm dying, but it was such a good session, so I'm very happy. And I just hit 100 for three. That is crazy. I only hit 100 like a month ago. To end a very, very good day, I had another protein shake. Shock horror, I know. So creatine, I had cranberry and raspberry flavour today. I have a lot of flavours of Clearway, guys. I, I got them all on sale, obviously. Another day, another me waking up in bed and opening the curtains with one foot and one hand because I can't be bothered to sit up to open it properly. <laughs> this is the best way to wake up, I'm telling you. By opening your curtains and getting that daylight in, you just start your day as if it's like a body clock thing if you have the day started with the bright light it just opens the day better hey vlog so i'm currently packing my wires bag for uni because every time i come home i end up plugging in this two meter USB-C cable that i need for university shocking i know um but yeah, it is half nine. I did wake up at 20 past eight and I did lie in bed for an hour. It's what it is. So that's the start of my day. But yes, I'm gonna pack up my stuff, grab some food from downstairs and head into the medical school. 
I don't have anything in person till 11, so if I'm heading in a little bit early, that's good. That means I can get started on some flashcards. I do have a hair mask in at the minute, which is more of my hair looks like this. And I'm kind of interested to see what happens because I never use hair masks. Like, I don't look after my hair. Um, and I really need to start looking after my hair because, yeah, <laughs> I do. It's just a fact. Anyway. Once I got to the medical school, I shockingly, I know, unpacked my bags and got on with eating my breakfast and having a little bit of a drink. I really needed a refresh because I forgot my water bottle, so luckily I had to pick up food on the way. I also saw Afreen for a little bit today. She was in the med school and honestly, it's been so good having her so close because I miss my friends so much. I managed to take off a couple things before I headed to my SGT for the morning. So, hey vlog, it's just gone. I'm looking around for the clock, it's literally right there. It's just gonna half room. I came home, I had a snack, and by snack I mean food, um, <laughs> because I was hungry and I haven't really had dinner dinner. Well, I had a sandwich, but I wouldn't count as dinner dinner. I'm I'm hungry, okay? I ate, mind blown. Anyway, I'm gonna get in the shower because I need to wash my hair mask out and just have a shower in general. Um, and now I haven't been to the gym yet today, I'm just wearing my gym clothes because I'm like, I get to go at some point. I have to finish my work first. My exam timetable came out today. So guess who gets to plan the next seven weeks of her life? And then book myself a holiday so I want to keep going. Yeah, I shouldn't, I'm going to. Um, I also need to do my finances and I need to build my jigsaw and go to the gym. There's a lot to do guys, but I'm gonna shower first and wash my hair, which is my main want right now because it's like the hair mask is it's good it's it's done oh hey vlog so i just did a little bit of self-care and had like shaved my legs you know the usual self-care girly things people do um i am quickly going to sit down and get some stuff done because i just watched a video that says said the mindset that changed my life immediately and it was three minutes long and i was like i might as well watch that and essentially the idea is one step at a time taking things step by step and eventually you get where you're going you don't need to make the biggest of changes you just need to make one step and my one step for today was to just work on one lecture on my to-do list and just prioritise things that I need to. So I've worked on prioritising. I drew out this little map, this timetable, and prioritised lectures based on my ability in them and what I needed to get done before the exams. So basically planning out my revision, essentially. Because I've finished all the content now, I want to get on with revising. So learning my flashcards, making sure I've done as many exam questions as physically possible and covered as much content. So once I finished planning, I took some well-needed rest and recovery because I'm about to have some very intense study weeks. So I decided to do my jigsaw for a little bit. I made flounder and Ursula. I don't want to say that wrong. But Little Mermaid is one of my favourite Disney princesses. So this jigsaw is just bringing back a little bit of my childhood memories. And I did this while watching some Percy Jackson as well. So even more childhood memories. Really, I'm just relaxing, guys. Somehow, no matter the fact that I was ready like half an hour, an hour ago, I'm still rushing around to get ready for the gym. Anyway, I'm just wearing basically what I've worn all day. I have this black Gymshark crop top on. This hoodie I got from Primark. Hoodie? It's like a, it's like a jumper. It's not a hoodie because it's not got a hood. Then I got my black University of Birmingham joggers on, pink Alphalete shorts, and some black, black? They're white, but okay. Some Kappa socks. I don't even know what they are. And then some che cheap, 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 trusty Primark knockoff Converse. But yeah, I'm heading to the gym. <laughs> Today I've got a new exercise called pin squats, which I've never tried before, but pin squats are basically another way of doing pause squats, which strengthens the bottom part of the movement for squatting. I am not quite sure. Um, whew, I'm out of breath. I'm not quite sure how to do them, what to do, weight-wise, any of that. So it is just going to be quite a bit of me figuring it out, moving around the safeties a lot, and getting a feel for... Pin squats, basically. It's a quite chill session. I've got pin squats and I think I have some feet up bench. 
and something else um i definitely have another thing on there but i might end up doing a little bit back as well while i'm there because this doesn't feel like a lot of working out if it's only like two or three things oh <sighs> yeah i should not be this out of breath but literally running up another stairs should i let's go to the gym <laughs> Let's imagine that this clip doesn't have copyright music behind it and you can actually listen to it. Oh gosh. This one is great, but I can't enjoy it because I'm stuck inside. I just finished at the med school. This sun is gorgeous. Oh, I love it. Anyway, I'm heading home. I'm meeting my friend Meg because she's going away to Singapore on Monday for like a whole month. So I'm going to meet her and do chill and spend some time with her before she goes back down south tomorrow and uh, see her for a month which is gonna be so sad because if you have a, if you've been watching the vlog i see her all the time anyway um so yeah i'm gonna do that and then gym session but i don't think i'll film much at the gym because i think my gym i like just being able to just gym that's why i tend not to film that much but i'll film me getting ready for the gym it could be a cute transition um and yeah that's it it's very boring. I couldn't film at uni because I was in the bathroom room and not at with them. Although the fit for the day has been super cute and it's super comfy, it's time to go to the gym. Yet another copyright song, but I was wearing these green Alpha Elite shorts and a black Gymshark crop. <laughs> Morning vlog. I'm awake. A bit. Oh my god. Whew. Anyway, I'm awake. I have. I need to sort my hair out. I need to put the hair on really in. I need to get up. Get about my day. It is Friday. Oh my god. It's Friday. The fact that it's Friday. This vlog started out so good and then it kind of like declined, but that's just me. But it's Friday. It's my last day of the vlogging, which is crazy. I need to edit and upload it tomorrow. But... <sighs> anyway, um, God, what was I saying? Brave heart. Anyway, I'm gonna put music on and get oop. Alexa, play my likes. Your playlist, my likes, on Amazon Music. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay, I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays, way back a year ago. I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change Been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same as they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago I spent a good two, three hours in the library before heading to the medical school for my SGT It was just me preparing Preparing for my SGT. Preparing is not English, Emily. <laughs> anyway, ignoring the fact that I cannot speak, I got on with my work and then headed to the medical school. It was such a gorgeous, gorgeous day and I love it. I'm leaving the main library and I did time my hair up because I got stressed out by it. Anyway, I'm heading to the medical school because I've got a session two till three. And I'm going to head back to the main library to study with a friend from first year um, that I used to live with. It is vibes. I like studying with people. It's nice to have somebody there. But here is hard. It is the last day of term before Easter. So I just want to get it done. Finish all the content, have everything done, everything ready so that as soon as next week comes around I can start revising. Because I've got so much to do. It just requires a lot of admin stuff to get ready. And I'm so nervous. 
And look at this new building. It's really pretty. That's nice. Honestly, it's so warm. I love it. I mean, it's not warm enough to take my jumper off, but it's getting there. It's getting there. I remember this time last year, I was in like shorts with t like vest top every day. I'm not quite there yet, but I feel like when I'm revising my exams, there is a potential. And you know what? I'm here for it. I need some summer, some summer in my life. As I used to in first year, I was extremely early for my SGT. So I ended up sitting down and going over one of my lectures. I only had two lectures left. Two! Two for the whole year, which is crazy to me. So I was just getting on with as many as I could. These ones were happening in person today and were a little bit different to last year. So I was just reviewing them and updating my notes as I watched the lecture on my laptop. It was so good. Oh, it's the last SGT done before Easter. Now I'm gonna head to the library and I'm gonna finish everything. It's all gonna be done, all the content's gonna be done, all my notes will be organized and ready. ready. I'm at the main library, I just got some food and this came in the middle. I'm not ready for this, but we're gonna get it done. Everything, everything, I'm done. Ah, uh, I'm home, it's six o'clock. I finished all of my lectures. I'm done, the content's done, I've covered everything. And I'm like, oh, maybe I can start revising my videos. No, I'm gonna do something for me because I just covered all my content, all of it. And I have work at 7 a.m. tomorrow, so I don't wanna be like stupidly late doing work. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go into the gym, obviously. Now, if you didn't know where that, that was, it, if you didn't know that that was where that was going, then I don't know what you were thinking about me. So, my fit for the day, I don't think this angle's great, but it's fine. And I'm gonna put my gym clothes on. So, I know you've seen this sports bra before, but it's the only white sports bra I own. And you use white when you're wearing shots this pink. But I'm wearing pink, and I'm going for the vibes. So, I hit a bench PR of 50 kg. 50. Like, that is crazy. Like, that is an aim I've been going for for ages. 50. So, yeah. I'll put the video in. Um, but it is portrait, so it's going to be, like, not fun to edit, but it's fine. Um, I'll put in the video, but I'm actually shocked and I'm so happy. I'm heading home now. I'm getting um, some food down there because I'm going to go to eat. And then I'm going to go to sleep. Um, but I'll try and close this book. I'll try. Because I'm not great at that, and we all know that. Yes, I forgot to close out the vlog, but thank you guys for watching. It's been an amazing week and I'm so glad that Easter starts next week. So subscribe down below and follow along to see what I get up to over the Easter holidays because I've got some big, big plans. Also drop me a follow on TikTok. I am starting to upload on there. And I will see you guys in the next video. Living life every day.